As the coach told us before the game, and he's going after him here. Flowers is roaming around looking for somebody else to fight. He just can't find it. Moves into the slot. Moves it quickly over to Hendricks. And that pass goes awry. The Nighthawks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Dishes it to Lafreniere. Fails to find the open man. Power play has expired. Made the stop on the play. Well, it ain't like that after that shot after the whistle. That one stung, and he's slow to get himself back together here, James. I want to look at that again. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Nighthawks win the draw. And here's the pass to Lafreniere. Backhander, and he rings the post. Pretty tough to come much closer than that, James. Nobody can score, but the posts aren't helping either. McKinnon's picking up steam. The Nighthawks have it now. Flowers gets a hold of the puck. No one home on that play. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Slides it on over to Pasho. And that one's picked off. Centering pass. And they come up empty-handed. Picked up along the boards by Hendricks. Long jam in front. That's broken up. The Nighthawks gain possession along the wall. Moves it to Pasho. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Quick pass to Flowers. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Takes control of the puck. Here's a short pass to Calico. And he slides it quickly to Flowers. Tries to get the puck over to Calico. Loses his balance on the play. That opportunity is rejected. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. Grabbed along the board by Hendricks. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Moves it to Flowers. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Slides the puck over. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Picks up the puck in his own end. Feeds it to Hendricks. The Nighthawks take over on possession. And now it's grabbed by Flowers. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Calico. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. The icebreakers scoop it up along the boards. Here they come. Sends the pass over. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. The Nighthawks have it against the wall. Puts it on net. Blocked in front. Quick feed to Hendricks. The icebreakers play it along the boards. Taken along the wall by Flowers. Can't get it to go. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. And that should do it. 20 more minutes in the books. That concludes the first period. Really, both teams still filling each other out here as we are still scoreless. heading down the tunnels we'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferrar, was also set. Let's do this. No goals yet through the first 20 minutes. Let's see if this changes here in period number two as we get underway.
the Nighthawks will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. And if you're one of these power play guys, James, you can't wait now. It's your first opportunity of the night. You get out on the power play, you want to make a difference. Save made by the goalie. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. They clear the zone. Quick feed to Keith. And now he tries to get it across to McKinnon. Here he is on the backhand. Big save in front. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. The Nighthawks gain control of the puck against the wall. Grabs control of it at the point. And they can't connect. The Icebreakers gain possession of the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed on that one. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through their fingers. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Slides the puck to Lafreniere. McKinnon's got it to the side. Hammers one at the net. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Lots of time left in this period. The game is still scoreless. Lafreniere's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. We've still got zeros on the board. A lot of John back and forth here. It's forever. I mean, the guys look like they're pretty agitated. Passes on over to Flowers. On the attack along the boards. And that slides right out to center ice. Calico's moving the puck through his own zone. The Nighthawks going to work on offense. The Icebreakers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Denied by the goaltender. Receives the pass. They move the puck out of harm's way. Scooped up along the wall by Hendricks. Along the half wall with the puck. The Nighthawks gain possession along the wall. The Icebreakers take possession of the neutral zone. And he scores!
Look, everyone, we're about to get underway here. The challenge has been laid. Don't sing it. Bring it. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. And there's the puck drop. Enough talk. It's time to find out what this is all about. Through center along the wing. Mean Machines got control of it now from their own end. Shakutami's got it across the line. Oh, he destroys them on the play. Couldn't connect on that pass. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Slides wow. it across and scores! Well, that was quick. I don't think the anthem singer's even in the car yet. That was fast. Montreal's got a 1-0 lead, and they've got their crowd on their feet here. Early on, the entertainment is here. Early lead for the home team. The first push for another. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Kudami's got the puck in their own end. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. We're still in the early stages of this period. 1-0 the score. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Offside is the call and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Lafreniere's won the draw here in the open ice. Gavlete, Plays into the body. From the left side, takes it at center. Maintains possession. Montreal's got a hold of the puck. And now he moves it quickly to McKinnon. They've got the defense outnumbered. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Oh, and that backfires. Yeah, he tried the bounce pass to himself. Didn't work. Here comes yeah, the pushback. Great defensive effort with the stick. LeJoy has done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. Drills him. Yeah, send in a message early there, James. He gets the body contact. And they can't convert to the play. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Pajot's going to the box for tripping. He's fishing around trying to get to the puck. Unfortunately for him, he sweeps out his feet. Uh -huh. Shakutami sent in their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Well, you hope they're ready for this opportunity, James, as it shows up as they're trailing by one. Now they get a man advantage and a chance to tie this game up. And that one's broken up. The Aces move the puck in the defensive zone. Trying to get it down the ice. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice. Get off the ice. Get some new people up there. Here he is all alone. Denies him on the breakaway. Really good speed to get out in front. Dust the pack. Now it's him and the goalie, but the goalie's better. He makes the stop. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. We got a one nothing game to this point. Lafreniere's won the draw. McKinnon's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Big save by the goaltender. His sentence. So often in a in a shifty little play that you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick, and there's nothing you can do. Here's a chance to set up now. Moves it quickly over to Lafreniere. He scores! That's two in a row! They got the first one, and I was really interested to see how they would respond. They kept the pressure on. He didn't have much room up over the glove, but as soon as the goalie dropped into the butterfly, there was enough for him to put it into the top bin. Montreal's won the draw in the neutral zone. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play's the right one there. 
cutting to the front of the net. Big play inside the defensive zone. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Moves the puck along the half wall. Can't connect. Shakutami's got the puck along the boards. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. McKinnon's got it along the wing. Here he is with the backhander. Whistle blows, and we've got a penalty shot. Tripped up on the breakaway. The ref makes the right call in signaling for a penalty shot. Big save, and three. That sigh of relief. The shooter's looking for a hole. There is none there. The goalie was all over it. Montreal's capitalizing their offensive abilities here in this first period. The Aces win the faceoff. Not able to connect. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Here he is in close. Stopped by the goaltender. Dead center. Excellent save. Halak's going to hang on to that one. And a face wash with the glove after the whistle here. Yeah, that's always going to provoke something, man. Somebody get a glove in my face. you got to push it back. You can't have them doing that to you. Montreal's won the draw. They'll go to work. Nothing doing on that. Moves it to Ryder. Sends a pass over. Montreal's gained possession along the boards. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Smart heads up. Play to neutralize the threat. Handles the puck. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick pass to Lafreniere. Can't find his man. And now he angles it across to Ryder. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. The Aces have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities and as a result have the lead. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Oh, what a block. He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. That pass doesn't go. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Into the attacking area from the left side. Takes control of the puck. Forces the turnover. Shakutami's got the puck along the wall. And a bad pass, and they'll be forced to start all over again outside the offensive end. Sure's got the puck. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. McKinnon's got it in the offensive zone. Centered out in front, and they can't connect. Mean Machines looking to break out of their own end. Montreal's got the puck here in the open ice. Shakutami's gained possession. He got robbed again. He's got to get his head up here. They're going to be carting him off the ice. And that'll do it. Period number one is in the books. Montreal's offense comes to life here early in this one. A couple of goals here in the opening frame. They lead it 2-0. with more action. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? The Aces have lots to like about that first period. And they control just about everything, including the shots, but more importantly, the goals. They're up by two. Here's a short pass to Ryder. 
And on the heels of that big hit, he's being called out. Balaz is looking for somebody to engage in a fight with. Yep, let's he go. can't find the right guy. Shakutami's got it in their own zone. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Into the corner, he takes the pass. How did he stop that one? Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Montreal's got the lead here early in this second period. Their offense has been clicking on all cylinders thus far. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Knocked away. Great defensive effort with the strip. Long pass into the neutral zone. Shakutami's got the puck. And now it's over to Ryder. Oh, what a stop! That's not even a rebound anymore. It's like a clear puck. Off the goalie and into the corner is a safe place. And he totally whiffs on that one. Big save! Stopped by the goaltender. High quality chance, high quality save. Drives to the paint! Strong defensive effort. Delayed penalty looming. Passes right to the front. Denied by the goaltender. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see what the officials are calling. Charging is the call, and I don't think anybody's going to argue this one. Nah, that's a frustrated player that had that bubbling up inside him. He sees a chance to make a big hit. He makes it, but it's too much. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Sends one across. Stopped by the goaltender. And they can't convert to the play. Just wide. Picked up along the wall by Peugeot. On the doorstep, here's a chance. Turns it away. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Montreal's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Moves it over to Lachois. And he moves it up to Lafreniere. Right in front. Dig can't connect. Scores! That was impressive! A bad power play can suck the life out of your team. One that looks like that and then scores a goal is a great boost. Montreal's offense came to play in a big way and they lead big time here in the second. Puck picked up in the open ice. Oh, he'll feel that one. Dumps it into the ozone. Textbook stop by Halak. Ryder's got the puck now in his own end. Mean Machines looking to break out. Carroll's carrying it ahead. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Shakutami's got it now. Whiffs on that. Scores! Well, now they're only down by a couple. I guess it gives them a chance. But they've got to score again quick. A sweet feed there. The butterfly pass goes across, and the shooter doesn't miss. Past the midway mark of the frame. Shakutami is still behind the eight balls. They trail by two goals. Montreal's got possession here in the neutral zone. Shakutami has got control of it now from their own end. Oh, you might call that the bank fire. Oh, the defender read that well. He read that bounce pass angle. Took it away. Couldn't complete the play. Tries to get it over to Pacho. And now he moves it to McKinnon. Heaves him up, and that's blocked. Slides the puck over to Ryder. Sends it out right in front, and they can't connect. Montreal's got the puck in the defensive end. Balance plays it against the board. Yep, let's go. Uses the force on that hit. Mean Machines got the puck along the boards. Takes the feed. Oh, he'll want to have that one back. Wayne Gretzky says 100% of the shots you don't take don't go in. Same for the ones that miss the net. What a steal in his own end. Quick feed to Don. Here he Woo! is from the slot. Scores! What a shot! The good thing he one-times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot. And he beats him clean. Shakutami's got a chance to change the complexion of this game now with that one. Yeah, get one now. They're within one. Don't take a step back. Push forward. Look for the equalizer. A shot. Blocker save. 
He got all of that one. Yeah, and it was that guy who's picking himself and his stick up off the ice. Moves it quickly over to Lafreniere. Can't catch up to the pass. Slides it over to McKinnon. And he slides it quickly to Pasho. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Costs it up in the neutral zone. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. And that one's turned away. Montreal's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. Moses to Pasho. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. There's the whistle and the official set to give the call. Now uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. Lafreniere's won the face off deep go. inside the offensive zone. Answered the call there. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. Period number two is in the books. There's been no shortage of offense tonight. Alongside Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabalski, ready to bring you period number three. Shakutami's penalty killers have their work cut out for them here, but a nice start to the period as they win the draw. Quick pass over to McKinnon. Pokes it away in his own end. Mean Machines got it in their own zone, and it's a quick pass to Carroll. Takes the feed. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. Takes the pass. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Carroll. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Mean Machines PK unit comes up clutch. Sometimes you go on the ice with the best of intentions and it goes all wrong right away. That's how I characterize that power play. He scores! That's two! Earlier in the game, he was able to score. I thought he's kept his energy up, and now has worked hard enough to get himself into position for another one. The Aces get themselves a big goal here to start this third. Really nice to get yourself a little bit more cushion, to stretch it out a little bit. You can see the finish line. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Montreal's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Here's a chance right out in front, and they can convert to the play. Feeds it over to Pajo. Quick pass to Lafreniere. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Unable to reach that one. And makes the save. Throws one up to Ryder. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Manages to hang on. Now a quick pass, and here comes the pushback. Lafreniere's ready to go. Apparently, the other guy doesn't want anything to and do with him. Stay there! Drills him! Moves inside! He scores! You're down by a couple. You want to give yourself the opportunity for a time goal. They've done that with this one here. Shakutami's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. From center, they get into the attacking area. Yeah, and he's going go. after him here. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Ryder's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. Hoarding is the call, and Ray, this is a tough one to argue. He follows through a little bit high, a little bit hard, and it made a lot of noise. Those are off the call. Here he is on the tip. He scores! That's three of the 
what an unbelievable night. It's at home. It's exciting. Everybody is into it. That's an outstanding game for him. Montreal's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Nice pass. Shakutami's got the puck in the corner. The Aces scoop it up along the boards. It's a three on one. Sends it across. Shakutami's looking to break out of their own end. Moves the puck. Here's a short pass to Carroll. Right to the middle. And it's a one goal game as he buries it. You want to make this thing believable for yourself. You've got to get away from that two goal deficit. They've done it here. And now they'll look for the tying goal. More than half the period left to play. Shakutami's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Wow. They scores! You get one, you want to think about a second one. It doesn't matter if you're at home or on the road, but you do this on the road, you feel a great accomplishment. And there's the one hat that he gets for scoring on the road. Hard to get a much quicker than that. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. You wonder what momentum is. Two quick goals will do it. Shakutami's got a little mojo back on their step after that goal here in the third. You work and you try and keep yourself light. You keep yourself aggressive. But if nothing happens for you, it gets pretty heavy. They feel good now. Well, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. There's a whistle as the official's calling for a penalty here. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. Stays with it, and now he tries to get it across to Don. And they fail to go tape to tape. And now he angles it across to Pajo. Picked off in the open ice. Comes up with a monster save in front. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Mean Machines won the draw. Rocks them. Stopped by the goaltender. Montreal's got the puck now. Directs it on over to Pacho. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. The centermen glide into position. Puck has dropped, and we are back underway. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Moves it around along the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. And as both teams are now back at even strength, the power play goes over on the opportunity. Gets more and more frustrating each power play that slips away in a particular game. They've had a bad night with the man advantage. Can't connect. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Carroll's one possession. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Sends the pass over. And he loses control of the puck. And that one's picked off in the neutral zone. Here they come on the attack. Quick feed to Carroll. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Slides it across to Lafreniere. Couldn't complete the play. And that one's broken up. They get it out of the defensive end. Yep, that's they go. Into the wall. James, there's the difference between getting by or getting crunched. He's a half a second from a great move. Instead, he got flat. Just here in the late stages of this frame, we got a tie game. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Good clearing attempt to breathe. The Aces get a hold of the puck along the boards. Works it across to McKinnon. Nice poke check. Tries to the crease. Stones him in front. Halak's going to hang on for a...
here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Montreal's won the face-off. And a great save! Takes it behind the net. Can't connect. Halak's gonna hang on and just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. Less than 60 seconds left in regulation. Picked up along the boards by Dawn. That's broken up in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to McKinnon. And that's picked off in front. Shakutami is moving it into the offensive end. Moved into the middle. Gives them nothing in front. Centering pass. He scores! Breaks the deadlock. Really good play at the net. And now somebody's got a lead. And we'll see if they can increase it. Shakutami's finally gone ahead here in this third period. Do you protect it now? No, not for me. I think you attack more. Just think if you can get another one. Then you can really be conservative and protect the lead. That pass goes a little sideways. Here they are on the attack. Shakutami's got the puck along the wall. Denies him in front. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Montreal's offensive struggles have been the story tonight. Lots of chances, just not a lot of results. The Aces win it. And that's picked off. Puck picked up by Dawn. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. We're going to have to flip these guys a rule book over there. They're offside all the time. Lafreniere's won the draw here in the neutral zone. There's the final horn, and this one's in the books. Well, they felt like they were ready for prime time, and I guess they were proven wrong. Yeah, time to go back to the drawing board. Challenge somebody else next time. Maybe turn that controller upside down, right?
Welcome back, everyone. Well, the gauntlet has been thrown down. The challenge laid. Who's up for it? Time to find out. Great energy both inside and outside the arena tonight as we are just moments away now from puck drop. The Aces take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Officials' arms going up in the air. He caught that hook too. And there's the whistle. Let's hear the official call. The good old-fashioned hook has sent him off to the box. He's almost in the right position, but he's got to give him a little hook. When he gives that punch, he goes to the penalty box and gets called every time. Montreal's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Their first power play of the game. The game is scoreless, and now they'll start offensive zone faceoff. Move the puck around, get it to the net, and try and impose your will on the other team. And that pass goes awry. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Picks off the pass. Solid check to slow him down. The Elite have taken over in the neutral zone. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Centering pass in front. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point-blank range. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Lafreniere's won it. Into the middle of the neutral zone. Right in the slot! He scores! Well, I don't think anybody's really settled into the game yet. Already we have the game's first goal. Montreal's home fans are back right on their feet again. Man, they just sat down. Now get back up. Everybody cheer, sit back down, and maybe they can do it again. Kane's won the draw here in the open ice. Slides the puck over. Kane's got it in the corner. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Couldn't find the intended target. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. Pachot's taking it from his own end. Receives the pass. Can't connect. Sends a pass over. Canada's on the attack. Slides the puck down low. Into the corner now. Comes up with the stick save. Smothered that in close chance. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Nice job tying up his opponent. And he stands tall in goal. The setters will glide into the dot. Canada's got it in the offensive zone. Huge stop on the one-timer. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. There's the whistle icing the call. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. You don't spend much time in your zone if you can win the draw like that. Ah, oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. There's the whistle. Penalty coming up. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the pocket. He gets his stick caught in their feet. Canada's won the draw, and they'll go to work. With the one-timer. Way too much. Congestion blocks that. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Here they come on the attack. Canada's got the puck against the half wall. 
The elite have it on the attack. Moves it to Petrangelo. Scores! And they take advantage! A really confident and run power play right from the way they entered the zone, the way they held on to the puck and moved it, and they found the open man. Lafreniere has won the draw. Bollocks plays the puck. No one home on that play. And that shot goes off the side of the net. Now over to Kane. Here's an odd man rush. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. A chance! And he comes up with a huge stop. Past the halfway mark of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. King's taking a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. Here comes the official's decision. You're a pretty good little leaguer. That's almost a home run swing. Uh, you make connection with that, James. That's a double. That's a penalty in hockey. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. When you've already scored on the power play and you get one now, you can't wait to get over the boards to get started again. Hammers the shot up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. The Elite have the puck on the attack. Montreal's penalty killers get a hold of it. The Elite have the puck in their own zone. And we've got a two-on-one. Big time stop there. The Aces gain control of the puck against the wall. Grabs it in his own end. Breezy's gaining momentum. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Centering pass, and he can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Takes a shot. Block. He scores. No hole in a second here. They're saying no goal. Immediately, this is waved off. This is not going to be a goal. The goaltender didn't like this immediately. It went past him. He looked right at the official. Play set to resume, and you can see they're still frustrated by that non-goal call. Montreal's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Tries to get the puck to Brandon. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. Quick pass to Brandon. No the nice timer. Kill. They Just score. Kill. This seemed like an inevitability here. Once a delayed penalty, arm goes up. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. Canada's got him along the wall. Centered out in front, and they can't connect. Montreal's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a short pass to McKinnon. Penalty coming up as the whistle stops the play. Breezy's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Like every player in the history of the game, he doesn't like the call, but he's going to have to go <laughs> serve his minor. It's a 2-1-0. Scores! He had to be ready for this puck to end up on his stick. He doesn't... to build on it. 